in May, followed by dry, hot temperatures, then rain. Okay, Colorado can be pretty tough on our skin. Also, on our hair, our nails, on everything. But uh, busy women usually have no time for all this. You can't get all this pampering all the time, but there are a few things you can do. We're going to give you some great advice all week. Quick fixes that are fast and will save you money on Beauty Confidential this week. So let's start with skin care. Uh, big pores, dryness, discoloration. Th those are some of the things our viewers said they want to know about. So welcome Kristen Carvone from Vital Medical Aesthetics in Cherry Creek. And Janice is here as a model today. Janice, I love your skin, but what's your issue? You. Oh, the dry weather here makes me look 10 years older every time. Okay. I just, oh, terrible. All right, Kristen, <laughs> what are we gonna do? Um, so today we're gonna be talking about exfoliation mm -hmm. and how to make your skin look really nice and protect it over summer. Just because we do have um, a lot of, you know, really, really hot days and a lot of, um, you know, very, we have very, very strong um, sun right. here too. Okay, let's get started. So you want to start out with your skin being a little bit wet. We're going to exfoliate her first. So I'm just going to dampen her skin. Okay. Oops. And then we're going to use an exfoliation. All right. And while you're putting that on, we're going to show everybody at home some of the, the three top tips that experts give us about what we can do at home that's going to make some of these treatments we get actually last. So let's take a look at them. The first one, exfoliation, which we're talking about right now, uh, which is very important to get those skin cells off. Then you're going to want to moisturize. Even if it's humid outside, you got to moisturize. Sunscreen, and then, of course, drinking a lot of water, right, Kristen? Tons and tons mm -hmm. of water, exactly. And so you want to kind of do this and rub it into the skin. You can leave this on for up to five minutes. Okay. And um, this one also has enzymes in it too, so it helps to work for chemical and manual exfoliation. Okay. And then you want to rinse it off. All right. So this is a pretty simple process. So obviously, this is something where people, if they can't afford to go and get a treatment done, can you go, how often can you go to actually have some benefit but not be spending a lot of money? Um, I say every four to six weeks, mm -hmm. optimally, but once every quarter during the year, too, as well. Okay. Um, and then these kind of things you can do at home in exfoliation like this, you can do up to twice a week. And like I said, leave it on for up to five minutes if you'd like. Okay. And it's really just going to give you a nice polish and help to get off that dead skin, get off, especially after winter right. when your skin gets really, really, really dry. So your investment, if you went one time every four weeks or so, what's your investment going to be in just a basic treatment where, that can benefit your skin? Um, between this and skincare, you know, about like $200, depending on if you wanted to do a facial and then get some product to take okay. home as well. All right. Well, what we're going to do is uh, go to our website, kdvr.com, and that there you're going to find all the tips that you need to, to kind of learn a little bit more about this, more than what time we have. Thank you so much, Kristen. Today from Vital, but what we're going to do tomorrow is makeup expert Michael Moore. There he is. He'll be here to show us how to instantly get rid of these bags you have under your eyes early in the morning when you're running out of the house, how to make your eyes look bigger, more awake in just minutes, and this is not going to cost a ton of money. Uh, we're also this week going to be talking about how to deal with hair in this weather, all sorts of stuff, and some natural things that can. Uh, provide you some beauty without having to pay much. That's Beauty Confidential all this week at 8.15 a.m. Let's go to Ken who doesn't need any.